Welcome back. Now, 4.6 million votes were registered for this man on Saturday night. But as you both know, guys, there can only be one pop idol. Best of luck to the pair of you. OK, guys. The winner of Pop Idol 2002 is Will! <laughs> Simon's here. Hello. Mr. Cowell. Hello. How are you? Very well. How are you? How um, recovered? Emotional, John. Emotional. <laughs> John emotional and drained. Darling. Was yes. Saturday night everything you hoped it would be? Yeah, it was unbelievable. I can't say I enjoyed it because I didn't. It was well, weird and I didn't. Why not? Because it was just odd, you know, because, you know, it's 50-50 vote, you get to know these people. You know, it's, you are involved with both of them. OK, both are signed to the record label, but you, you can't help yeah. it, you, you get affected. And I have to say, looking at when that clip we've just seen, looking at their expression, they just looked they absolutely didn't know. Oh, no. terrified, yeah. didn't they? They really were. I it went up to them like... seconds before they went on to do that, and I said, look, you've really got to understand something here. This is not like the loser's going to walk away with nothing. Mm. You're both stars. For Christ's sake, enjoy it. But it was like, you know, rabbit in headlights. Yeah. So. I mean, it is an incredible thing for them to take in. Yeah. I mean, even for you, your life, I mean, you've been in the business for a long old time, but even now Not you're finding <laughs> your, you as a person in the spotlight. So, I mean, you've been coping with that, but for them, I mean, it must be phenomenal. Well, I think they're both... Um... Actually, they're both really ambitious. So whatever mm. they said about not wanting to win this competition, mm. they wanted to win this competition. And, and, and with regards to two finalists, chalk and cheese, really? Yeah, yeah, and, that was good for us. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I think if we'd have had both people chasing a direct pop market, it would have been a problem. So now we can launch Will for a slightly older audience. I mean, I think you'd like his records, Jane. <laughs> and, then <you'd, laughs> and then you'd have... Uh, <laughs> Then you'd have Gareth going after like the younger, more Westlife audience. So they're not going to compete with each other. But the yeah, Westlife, Gareth. Yeah. I mean, I, I I look at Gareth as my son. Yeah. And mm. I could actually have given birth to Gareth. Yeah. It has to be said. Really? But at where, quite an old age. Westlife <laughs> are, are you? I mean, people that you've been working with. So in a way, were you disappointed that was well not Gareth compared to the, the the stable mates that you have at the moment? Was I disappointed, sorry, that... That Will won, not Gareth. For yeah, I was, actually, yeah. And uh, it's very difficult for me, because being a judge on the show, you know, you're supposed to, you're supposed to give an honest opinion. Yes. And, then it, and be so, neutral. Yeah, and be neutral. And then, of course, with two weeks to go, you're like, uh, both of them are probably going to be signed to me, so should I be nice to them? And I thought, oh, sod it, no. But it was very much slanted to... I mean, even all the papers, you know, Gareth was one on the front, because he's kind of got those classic good looks. Mm. And, 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 I mean, the song Evergreen is, is really more for Gareth's voice than for Will's, isn't it? Well, I didn't think so. I thought it was a good song because it, it was a great lyric, you know, I'm going to take this moment and make it last forever. We, we tried him out in the studio, Will, and he was a bit sort of like, oh, you know, I don't sing songs like yeah, this. So yeah, he's very Jamiroquai, Steve Wonder, isn't Try it. it. And yeah. then he sung it and, and he loved it. And, and I thought he sung it really, really well on the night. Yeah, he really was very well. good on the night. But I said to him, that funny enough, I remember I was sitting in the studio with him about two or three weeks ago, and we did this track, and I said, you know what, you're going to win this competition. He went, do you think so? I went, yeah, I think you are. I can actually feel... Mystic Cowell. The mood. I was a bit like that, yeah. <laughs> and uh, I said, I'm still going to go for Gareth, because, you know, I've supported him from the beginning. I'm not going to slag you off, yeah. you know, but, you know, obviously I am in the, the Gareth camp, so to speak. And, uh, so what about all this... Furore over the phone vote, saying it's rigged and lines were alloc less lines away, were it? allocated to to Gareth. Well, I don't think I don't think it's rigged. Um, I think what I mean, I'm guessing here because I don't know enough about it. My guess is is that when you've got you know mm. nine million calls yeah, are registered, like, Christ knows how many actually came in. You know, you're going to get some kind of weird things going on. But as far as I'm concerned, it was a fair vote, um, and uh, you know, the best guy on the night won. I think. Mm. I mean, well, you talk about the ambition there, because he, he, uh, he's popped up before, hasn't he, Will, on this very programme. Really As, in fact, has yourself. Yeah, are we not going to show that? <laughs> we are going to show the clip, <laughs> yes. <laughs> you guess. But this, was, this was boy band editions uh, three oh, years God. ago, actually. Yeah. But, boy, the boy could still sing then. You and I must make a pact we must bring salvation back where there is love i'll be there don't you know baby yeah 
I'll be there. I'll be there. Just call my name and I'll be there. Oh, you escaped a close-up, Simon. Thank yes. God for that. I thought I was going to come up with some gem there. Can you remember? Yeah, I can, actually. I remember thinking at the time he looked like Howard out of Take That. Right. And I thought he was good. Interesting, of course, he's singing a pop record there. Mm. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that, you know, that's one thing I have to say about the competition. You come into a competition called Pop Idol. Yes. And then at the last minute you say, oh, but I'm not releasing a pop record. It's like, well, hang on a minute. Yeah. You know, it's a pop, it's a pop competition. Yeah. You know. And Gareth does, I must say, in the white suit, he looked absolutely sensational. So much so, actually, that one of the uh, <clears throat> uh, presenters on the evening has worked out a technique <laughs> to help Gareth with his speech. Have a look at <laughs> Kate's left hand, Simon. <laughs> and if there's one person, you know, who really deserves it, you know, it is Will. He's, he's absolutely... Yeah, you know, he, he's, you know, I don't know, he's, um, uh... He's uh, your mate, isn't yeah, exactly, he? He's become yeah, really good friends, this, especially this last week. Yeah, exactly, yeah, we are really good friends, and, yeah, he's, yeah, he's an awesome guy. He's talking oh, beautifully. brilliant. God, no <laughs> wonder he's had problems with well, catering well, that. <laughs> Well, way of putting your interviewees at ease, isn't yeah. it? Fantastic. Do you want to try it over here, yeah. Jane? <laughs> look at your body yeah. language. She's like this. He hate look. No, no, no. I like you too. Mm. Oh, that's all right. I don't know why, but I do. What's <laughs> going to happen now with uh, with yourself with the uh, the format? Is it going to go to America? I mean, obviously, you're going to be busy with Will and Gareth. Mm. But aside from that. Well, priorities, first of all, is you've got to make these two guys into stars. That's all I care about at the moment. The American thing. May know. happen. May happen. Fifty-fifty. Oh, I'm Who convinced. Knows? Don't know. I'm convinced it'll if happen. If it happens, because yeah. you, as a, yourself and the other chap, Simon, own yeah. the format. Well, no, he owns the format, I own the recording rights. Right. Yeah. Um, and uh, I think it's the right thing to do. It might be fun. I mean, I would just hate the idea of going over there as this sort of perceived git. Nasty. You know. Yeah. Because... You've got a lot of flack for that, but in, in fairness to you, that's what the music industry is like. Oh, exactly. You're not saying anything that, that is unusual, are you? Well, precisely. I mean, it was like, I remember when I said, you know, Darius, you weren't very good tonight. No. And, and Waterman sort of, you know, attacked me. <laughs> and it was like, Pete, I said he wasn't very good this yeah. evening. That was it. <clears throat> you know, think about some of the things you've said. Everyone got very, very over emotional yeah. on this, you know. But uh, I think, you know, people came round, and I think 99.999% of the population now agree with me. <laughs> <laughs> and if you're that one percent, then do fall in because we'd like to. Finally, Simon, what um, what made Will win on Saturday? What did he have? You know what, John? X Factor. Really, yeah. you know, we kept talking about it, mm. and I think that final really showed what it was all about. You know, I mean, how did those guys get on stage that night and sing live? Do that. Mm. Yeah. I couldn't talk. And he got the Darius vote as well, I think. Do you think so? The more middle of the road. The yeah. older, as you said very kindly about me, <laughs> the older vote. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think they all transferred from Darius over, over, to, to Will. over to Will. And who did you vote for? Do you know, I didn't actually vote. I watched. Who did you want to win? I was at a party and being very boring, watching Pop Idol. Right. But I wanted Will to win. Mm. Right. Well, stay with us. More tea for Simon. Thank you. Because he's going to be here taking your calls, and uh, one of you will be winning thousands with Money Bunny. We'll be back in a couple of minutes. By the way, I love your. Welcome back. Well, you've been calling in on your millions <laughs> with your uh, <laughs> verdict of uh, a very old pop title today. Um, Simon, we've got Hannah here from Norfolk. Hello, Hannah. Hello. Hello, darling. Hi. Um, my question is, if Will and Gareth release a record on the same day, who do you think will sell more? Oh, that's a good question. Uh, are you saying the same record, Hannah, or different records? Different records. Well, I think it would depend on the song, but I think if they oh, both... Oh, don't be so old-fashioned. <laughs> <laughs> Typical Sun journalist. Here. They're so aggressive. <laughs> um, all right, uh, Gareth. There you go. Mm. Okay. After, after a bit of prodding from Jane, you got your answer, Hannah. <laughs> okay, thank you. Um, thanks, thanks for calling in. Uh, Bruce, line. Hi, Bruce. Hi, yeah. Uh, Hello. What would you like to ask, Mr. Cowell? Uh, uh, hi, Simon. Hi, uh, Bruce. I'd like to ask you. I heard in the papers that um, there was supposed to be a celebrity edition of uh, Pop Idol. 
If so, uh, who would you like to appear on it? Who would I like to appear on it? Yeah. Um, oh God, that's a really good question. Um, who would you like to have a go at? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> a band I hate. A1, A1, so I can slag them off Ooh. for their faces. Oh, A1, mm. there's a challenge for you. Mm. <clears throat> Bruce, who would you have on it? Uh, I think, uh, John, you should go on it, cos uh, you, you did the uh, bit on the piano with Hayley the other week. So, Thank uh, you very much. And he hit a very good high note when he had his mm. legs waxed, just. <laughs> she hasn't recovered from that yet, actually. Yeah. But, She's Bruce, I let my fingers do the talking. Unfortunately, I don't have a, I don't have a voice there. <laughs> right, well, actually, Bruce, talking of that, we've got um, the delightful Hayley, uh, Hayley's mum on the line. Hello, Karen from Birmingham. Hello there. Karen, Hi, your, um, your daughter's fantastic, by the way. Thank you very that much. That was an amazing thing she did, but you've got a question for our man here. I have, yes. Um, good morning, Simon. Hi, Karen. How um, are you? You put the vote to the public. Um, yeah. You've said you were disappointed with the outcome. Yeah. And you'll still make Gareth the superstar. No, we'll make them both superstars. I know you will, but you do prefer Gareth. <laughs> and you actually signed a girl who didn't get through to the final ten, so do you really listen to the public? <laughs> 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 That's quite aggressive, that. <laughs> uh, she apologised. Well, you know, we decided from the beginning that the public should choose. Um, mm. But believe it or not, we are human beings and we do have favourites. Mm. You know, we can't just sit there and say, well, the public like that one, so now we all like them as well. And when you see someone in the early stages and you like them, why shouldn't you sign them? Mm. Is, um, is Gareth a favourite of yours because you know he's a pop potential or is he actually a favourite because you like him? I liked him as a person, John, actually, yeah. And as I said, look, I mean, t it's ridiculous to say that when you, when you work all this time that you're not going to have a favourite. And mm. if you say that you haven't, you're a liar. Yes, not Everyone true. has favourites, <clears throat> you know? And, um... Yeah, it's boring if you play devil's advocate. Oh, it's, it? it's boring. You know, <laughs> I like them 50-50. Yeah. Mm. You know, yeah, right. <laughs> There's okay, never been a fence that you've ever sat on, Simon. It has to be said, <laughs> isn't it? Thank you, John. <laughs> Let's take another call. Sophie. Hi, Sophie. Morning. Um... I've got a couple of pointers to make, and I just wanted to know what Simon thought about them. Mm -hmm. um, talk of the new series. Um, do you think it would work if we did the new series next year? I mean, I personally think you need to leave it maybe a couple of years to generate mm. a new set of talent. Um, I think he's a couple of years break as well. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah, exactly. A break from Simon Hay. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. You don't mean that. <laughs> you don't mean that. What, was your, what was your other point, Sophie? Um, and also, we, um, I know there's been sort of talk in the papers and things about the vote, fit, you know, uh, votes being fixed and one thing or another. Um, personally, and I know this may sound extremely sad, I managed to place, <laughs> get ready for this, 180 votes on Saturday night, 100 online and 80 by phone. For who? Uh, Will. Wow. Right. Yeah. So, admittedly, we were at a sort of get-together and I had the phone glued to my ear. Um, but I just think for people to turn around and say, oh, you know, it's been fixed and one thing or another, I think if you were determined enough to get through, you could have done. Exactly. I wouldn't like your phone bill, Sophie. Oh, yeah. well, it wasn't mine. <laughs> <laughs> ah, wise woman. <laughs> Sophie, what do you like about Will so much? Um, I think that, that for, um, on the night, I feel Will had a, a tougher sort of mountain to climb, if you like, in the sense that um, I didn't think the songs were necessarily completely suited to um, the style he likes to sing in. Mm. Um, and I think that sort of on the night, um, possibly the floating voters that would have voted for Darius yeah. um, felt that, you know, he'd sort of risen to the challenge perhaps slightly more mm. than, than perhaps Gareth. I don't know, that's just my personal mm. view. Okay, Sophie, Good couple of points. You. What do you make of Sophie's point there about I've forgotten them. Two, <laughs> two years break? Well, it, it does because you see a, a lot bit, of people. doesn't it? From Listen, Jane, everyone said, when I said the same thing, when I found out, you know, that there were 23 episodes and we got to the final <laughs> <What>? ten, <laughs> 10 more, I thought, yeah, God, everyone's going to switch off, you know. But, uh, you know, they're not stupid at ITV. If they think it's going to work, it'll work. It'll if run. I said the same thing about Big Brother, oh, you can't do that again. And mm. uh, I think the second one was better than the first, it was, actually. actually. You know, I didn't agree. have that stupid mm. Craig in there, you know. More right. interesting <laughs> people. Uh, we got, uh, is it Vicky now? <laughs> Where are we going? Vicky from London. Are you Hi. There? Hello, Vicky. No, um, this, is, this is a good question, Vicky. You're through to Simon. Hi, Simon. I wanted to know um, whether you were going to um, bring out an album that's true to Will's style or whether you're just going to rush out a, a mass-produced pop album. Pop market kind of feel. I have, yeah. a, mass -produced? I, I have a feeling people are slightly <laughs> cynical about people in the music industry. It's funny that. 100% um, with Will, he's going to make the album he wants to make. How much freedom will he have, though? A lot, honestly, right. yeah. Will he be allowed to write? 
Um, he'll definitely make the album <laughs> he wants to do. <laughs> <That's laughs> I don't know if he can write songs or not, to be honest with you. If he, you know, he's going to be working with Burt Bacharach and people like that. You know, Fantastic. He, he, he's making an album which is true to him and I think true to the mm. audience. Yeah. And, and honestly, I think anyone who is a Will fan will really, really like this we, album. We saw Kylie, you know, say a few words on the night. Have you had any phone calls from any of your kind of artists or anybody else in the industry saying, you know, that Will or that Gareth, well, this is what we think? No. no. Not at all? Okay. No. We've got some emails. <laughs> that was my stupid question. <laughs> We've got, got some emails here. Helen Barrow wants to know, so if we take out the, fi the two finalists, out of the final ten contestants, who were you the most sorry to see go? Darius. Darius. Yeah. Ah. Yeah, I really, really, really liked him. Yeah. Uh, because he's mad. <laughs> uh, he is. He's really, really funny, and uh, he's a really, really nice guy. And whenever this guy walks into a room, People are interested. People right. feel the love. Yeah, and I felt a lot of love. You know, we're signing him up. Are you? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. So how many? Is that four of the top ten? We've got, well, no, three in the top ten. We're going to sign, and uh, and it was all to do with that performance of. Um, you know Tom that Jones. Will be Tom Jones, Jones yeah. Tom Jones. I thought he was absolutely yeah. fantastic. And he and had a bit of sex appeal, which he hadn't really had definitely, before. Definitely, yeah. And he's getting better and better, this have guy. Have songs for all these people all of a sudden? Well, I think, you know, for, for Gareth, we've, we've got our kind of pop writers. Mm -hmm. Will is a very different kind of thing, so we're not competing. And, and I think with, uh, with Darius, you know, he's a crooner. And, uh, you know, one and a half million people voted yeah. for this guy. Yeah. You know, and that he's got buy big... one album. Hmm? That they'll buy one album. He will then have his double platinum, platinum. album. There we go. <laughs> that would be fantastic. <laughs> Another email. Um, are there any plans to release the cover versions that Will sang on the show? Um, I, I liked Light My Fire. I thought it was awesome. Um, but um, Joe Hughes here uh, wants to know if she can get hold of a copy of Night Fever. That would be a good album, I suppose releasing what they sang on the night? Oh, uh, you've got to be careful not to put too many covers on, but I know that I think there were two songs in particular he really loved, and obviously one of them was Light My Fire, and, you know, that will be released at some point. And I also thought he sung Ain't No Sunshine brilliantly. Mm -hmm. yeah. Brilliant. <clears throat> mm. but night, <clears throat> night Fever we don't know about yet. Not sure about Night Fever. OK, I've, I think Will would be sure about Night Fever either. I don't think honest, so either, no. Okay. Thanks, Joe, for that one. Thank you. Another one? Uh, yes, now what have we got here? Um, Hmm, don't know which one to go with. Here we go. Simon, to me, this is seems to be anonymous, this one. <laughs> to me, Will does not sound or look like a pop idol. To me, he has the style, versatility and voice to be much more. Are your changes to him going to have to be quite dramatic? No, I don't think we've got to change anything, Jane, to be honest with you. Mm. Honestly. You know, he is what he is. Mm. Just a really, really good singer. Really good singer. Yeah. Mm. yeah and, good and, you singer. know, one thing about these guys is, is that they've both got... You know, forget the four and a half million. Let's assume that even more people trying to get through. These guys have got something like maybe seven, eight, nine, ten million fans each at the moment. Straight away. It's like that... millions more than the, even turned out for the general election, isn't it? Yeah, it's incredible. I think we should do pop idol election, and we'll judge them. We'll tell them if they're in the middle <laughs> or not. <laughs> you can imagine they'd all be claiming that people yeah. couldn't get through all the phone lines, even more <laughs> politicians. Goodness me. We've got one from Holly, aged 11, from Whitley Beat. Thanks, Holly. Um, Simon, how do you feel about Ant and Dick making fun of you just about every show? Oh, I've had sleepless nights, so... Really? <laughs> I'm really upset. Are you going to miss them? I am going to miss them, yeah. actually. I think they're funny, those two. They are very Because, actually, they're really as bad as me. In fact, even worse. They came and over that. that was, there was a kind yeah. of love-hate response. I really, them. really like them. I think they're very smart, these guys. Uh. Yeah. I like it when they take the mickey. It's great. You're going to go to America. I know you're going to. You're going to be huge in America. Because they'll love... I mean, they've, they've really gone for that kind of nasty tag now because of the Anne Robinson mm. thing, haven't <clears> they? <throat> and next. I think that they'll love you. They'll be going, mm. I can't believe he's saying that. Simon and Anne Robinson. <laughs> <laughs> Please. I, I don't know if she'll like the same bars as you, Simon. But <laughs> well, I've seen you in all of them, John, so <laughs> I would be very careful. <laughs> <laughs> um, don't let the sun go down on me, obviously, went there very well at the weekend. A couple of calls about that. Uh, is it going to come out? Uh, we'll see, we'll but see. Like, it yeah, did there's... work, didn't it? OK, um, and we've got another call, I think, have we? Have we got, have we got one more email? OK. I think we've run out of emails. I've got an email. <clears throat> Do you make think... one up. Why are you so good-looking? Just make it up. Well, Simon, I'm very good-looking because... <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> we're, we're going to you... see the charity, um, Pop Idol, next. Are we, are we are, are we? No. We're not going to see no. that? No. 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 Uh, they decided at the last minute they couldn't do it. That's no, not just, happening now? No. All right. I no. want to put you on the spot, because 
on ITV2, you were talking about Gareth and this announcement in, the, in a week's time, and you said it's going to be really exciting. So I think you should give us an exclusive. Definitely, tell us. Jane. The announcement <laughs> we're going to make is. God, I've forgotten what it is now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, okay, we've got plenty of time. <laughs> It'll come to me. Is it Gareth and Zoe? <laughs> Wait and see. Oh, oh, that was a wink. That was no, a it's wink. No, it's not that. I promise you, it's not it's that. It's not that. Right. It's not that. Oh, okay. Yeah, you'll love it, Jane. We believe you. Well, now it's uh, Simon's favourite part of the show. <clears throat> this is a piece, <laughs> piece of music that he uh, wrote specially for oh, us. Oh, I love this music. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we give you. <laughs> Thank you, Simon. <laughs> Money, buddy. <laughs>